Brooke, for those of you who don't know me. I am an eight-star diamond coach, two-time elite coach, and after two years of coaching, I hit the official six-figure yearly mark for income. Um, my husband and I just added up our total earnings between all of our business centers, including his, and we're actually at the $900,000 mark since we started coaching, which is so incredible and completely blew my expectations out of the water. Um, I retired my husband at the age of 31 from a retail management job that he hated. Um, he was never home. He never got to see the kids. And we got to the point where we're like, we budgeted and we looked at the finances and we realized this was something that was doable for our family. So we are so grateful to Beachbody and I wanted to come on here and share with you how we've been able to maximize the coach compensation plan. Um, so we've been able to do this with my husband on my strong leg. So today I'll be talking about the strong leg and how we've been able to maximize. I actually made some graphics um, so you guys could share them with your teams. And then I realized they're backwards on camera. So I'm actually going to share my screen with you. But before I do, I wanted to preface with a couple of things. First, I know you guys know it's coming. Uh, Beachbody does not guarantee success or income with the Team Beachbody opportunity. Each coach's income depends on his or her own efforts, diligence, and skill. So basically, you got to work for it. Nothing worthwhile comes easy. And um, because we're talking about a spouse account, I just want to be clear with this as well. Um, Beachbody allows us to help build a spouse account, but if you are building or helping to build a spouse account and coach relations were to call your spouse, they must know, number one, that they have an account and what's going on with that account. It can't be 100% you building for them. They, they can't say to coach relations, I don't know about this account, I don't touch it or something like that. So um, just wanna make sure you guys are aware of this. And I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen, that way all of the little downline things make sense, okay? Okay, let's go ahead and get this started. Um, I'm gonna try my best to make this make sense to you because I know when I first started as a coach, all of this was super confusing to me. I had to watch a ton of YouTube videos on placement and strong leg and weak leg and I just had a hard time wrapping my brain around it. And I know this can be a little complicated, so I'm going to try my best to break it down in really simple steps for you guys. Um, when I started as a coach, I knew my first goal was I wanted to be Emerald. So the first two people that I invited into my business to support me were my husband and my mom. So not really thinking much of it and not knowing which leg were my strong or my weak, I placed my husband on my left leg and my mom on my right leg. After hitting Emerald, my next goal was to hit Diamond and I started recruiting coaches on my outer left and my outer right legs because in my training that's what I learned was the right thing to do. Never place anyone on an inside leg. Always place on the outer leg because that helps everyone in your downline. Um, I noticed that more of my volume was accumulating on my left leg so my left leg became my higher volume leg which ultimately ended up being my strong leg. Now I know you guys know um, from the basic compensation stuff that Lindsay posted the other day that every 100 points you have on your weak leg, you make one team bonus cycle off of every 200 points you have on your strong leg. So every time this leg right here reaches 100 points and this leg reaches 200 points, you make one team bonus cycle. And as an Emerald coach, that is $14 for each bonus cycle. So that's what I was making as an Emerald coach. But I also knew once I became Diamond that those, um, those bonus cycles increased to $18. So that was my next goal. So I knew in order for my business to get to Diamond rank that I needed an Emerald coach on each leg. So I started by helping my husband's business get to Emerald first. Um, and as I did that, I noticed not only was I getting the $14 bonus cycle because my weak leg was reaching 100 points, but I was also getting a $14 bonus cycle in my husband's business every time this person on his weaker leg renewed their order. And I also made $1.40 in matching bonuses because my husband is my PS coach. So instead of making just the $14, I was making around 
$29 just having my husband as a PS Emerald in my organization, which is pretty cool. Um, now, generally, your weaker leg is the leg most people focus on and build because it's your money-making leg. But I started to notice that, you know, he was making bonuses over here. And I started thinking, what if I started growing this side right here? I would be making bonuses over here and he would be making bonuses over here and that would increase our income. So I'm going to show you how we did that. Now, like I said earlier, we are taught to place on our outer legs and I still believe this is something that we should do, but I always tell my coaches, place on your outer legs so it helps your entire organization until you get to someone you love. So that person could be your husband or yourself if you're opening a second CBC, or maybe even a parent who actively works the business. Um, for now, I'll just use my husband as an example. Say I need a diamond on my left leg but I don't want to place a coach that I know is ready to go all in with the business and build a strong business. I don't want to place that coach on my strong leg because generally that's the leg that makes me no money. But what I can do is go into my graphical genealogy and make sure I'm logged into my CBC1 and I can go in and graphically place one of my PS coaches that's in my own business within the weak leg of my husband. So I know that sounds confusing, but I can actually place my own coaches on his weak leg and it's still considered my left leg and my strong leg. But I actually make money because my husband will bonus cycle off of my PS coaches that I'm placing on his weak leg. Now as my husband's bonuses started to grow and his team that was placed under him started to blow up. It only made sense for me to help him get from emerald rank to diamond rank so he could increase his team bonuses from $14 to $18 per cycle. I continued to build my own weak leg and while placing CBC1 coaches within the weak leg of my husband and helping him build a diamond rank. So once he became diamond, I was receiving $18 team bonus cycles every time my weaker leg hit 100 points and my strong leg hit 200. My husband was making $18 bonus cycles every time his weak leg hit 100 and strong leg hit 200. And I was making $1.80 every time for a matching bonus per $18 bonus cycle. So as you see listed here, all of those numbers, that's a lot higher um, in income rather than if I were to just solely focus on my weak leg and I wouldn't have done any of this with my husband's. So my next step was get to two star. Um, the nice thing about having your spouse on your strong leg, like I said earlier, is you'll always have that solid diamond on your strong leg and you don't have to sacrifice placing a potential rock star coach on that leg that generally doesn't make you any money unless you place them on your husband's strong leg and you make bonuses regardless. Um, so once I hit two star, I open my second CBC on my weaker leg to build volume on that leg. By doing this, staying two star and achieving the two star bonus each quarter will always be up to me having my husband's account on one leg and CBC2 on the other leg. So this way I just have more control over my business and my rank. I pretty much build my CBC2 the same exact way I helped my husband build his business. I can graphically place CBC1 coaches um, that I want to be personally sponsored by my first business. I can graphically place them within the legs of my CBC2. Say I want to go for 10 star or 15 star. I'm able to do that by utilizing the graphical genealogy and just placing them within this business center. But I can still go for volume by doing that as well because I'm building both legs of CBC2 even if it comes from CBC1 coaches. So at this point, I'm an eight-star diamond coach. My husband is a two-star diamond coach, and my CBC2 is a diamond coach. And at this point, I make team bonuses off of my own weak leg, um, team bonuses from my husband's account, 
15 bonuses from CBC2, and I also make matching bonuses from all the coaches in my organization that are making team bonuses themselves. So I know all of these numbers look pretty small at first, um, but I can promise you through consistency and patience, as you can see down here, those numbers do add up over time and it's residual and it's pretty incredible. So this is the exact strategy that we've used to maximize our personal income and to create a six-figure income and a total of $900,000 since we've started Beachbody, which is amazing. Um, so I hope this helps you guys and post any questions you have for me below. I'd be happy to answer them.